Hello, my name is Onye Dika Maobi, CEO of Thimbo's Creations. I am a fashion designer, a pattern drafter, and a pattern drafting trainer. It's my pleasure to welcome you to today's online class. So, I'm going to talk about something special to me today. Okay, before I continue, I want to give you a small, 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 small gist. When I started sewing newly, I couldn't, I didn't know the difference between bias flay and full flay. I thought a flay is flay, you know. So today I want to show you the difference between your bias flay and your full flay. I know some people still have this challenge, you know, in their sewing life, in their, you know, sewing profession to understand the difference between your full flay and your bias flay. So, Today, by God's grace, I'm going to talk about how to differentiate between um, your full flay and your bias flay. First, your full flay is 360 degrees, you know, you know, it, 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 360 degrees makes up a circle, okay? So, when you talk about full flay, you talk, you are talking about what? 360 degrees. So, see you in class. So these are two fabrics. I want to cut one as a full flay, that is as a 360 degrees flay, while I'm going to cut the other as a bias flay. This now I want to cut as a full flay. This is the way I fold it. First, I fold the two edges to meet this way into two equal parts, okay? Then, I also fold into two again. That gives me what four places. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, okay. Let's say I'm using four uh, for this class. I'm going to use four inches as the radius. So I take four inches from this point now. And I'm using like um, five inches as the length of the flay. Huh? Did you see it? This is a full circle, a full flay, okay? So this for our bias flay, we are going to um, fold this as a triangle, okay? This is it. Fold it as a triangle. It is folded as a triangle. If I still want, there's an, I can still do it this way, fold into two this way and still fold as a triangle, depending on the um, um, on, what, on the effect I want to achieve, on the size I want to get. But for this class, I'm going to fold it directly as a triangle, okay? So after folding, getting a triangle, at one of the points here, I'm going to take four inches. Remember, we said for this class, we are using four inches. The four inches, we take it, I know. So then, then um, the length of our flay is five inches. So from this point, okay. So, and it's time to cut. Now, I'm going to show you to compare these two. So this is a bias flay, and this is a full flay, okay? 
Did you get that? That's the end of the class. Was it interesting? Did you get something? Did you grab something? Please, um, I hope you did. Follow us on Instagram, on Facebook, at Thimbles Creations. And um, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, at Thimbles Creations. Also share this video to people that you feel they need it so that they will also learn. See you next time.